I think this is the right side of the road. Okay, yeah, I think he lives over here. Dang, that guy doesn't even know. Oh, thank you. Damn it, move! Hey, great hair. Whoa, God, which street does he live on? Was it no. this one? No, I think it was this one over here. Oh, shoot! I, the, oh, the, the police, I better pull over for them. Wait, are they stopping me? Oh no, did I do something wrong again? Yo, I don't want to go back to jail. What the heck is this guy doing? What the? Listen, kiddos, just listen to me, and we'll get out of this just fine. These cops definitely won't shoot us. Hello there. Hello there, deputy. How can I help you? Deputy Jackson with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. We want to get you stopped because you were driving on the wrong side of the road. Wrong side of the road? I think you're mistaken, deputy. I was driving on the right side of the road. So, are you aware what country you're in? Yeah, we're in... Wait... Yeah, we're in the U.S. Yeah, 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 the U.S. Yeah. Okay, the United States of America. Yeah. You are aware that this state goes on the right side of the road. You have you seen that? my glasses? No, I have not. Oh, everything's a little fuzzy. Uh are you supposed to be wearing glasses while driving? Oh, is that what I was forgetting? If you were, if you are supposed to wear glass wear glasses while driving, so you can actually see where you're going, then that's more than likely going to be the issue. Well, then can you help me find my glasses so I can be on my way? Did you do you remember that you bring them bring them with you? Of course, I always have them with me. I just don't know where they are. Okay. Well, before, before I try to, well, look at that. Look at what? Glasses on your shirt, right there. Oh, <laughs> my bad. I'll put those on after. Okay. Could I just get your driver's license, registration, proof of insurance, please? Yeah, here you go. Okay. Thank you. Can you clarify the name on this? Yeah, it's J it's Jake. Jake. Yeah. Wait, can I see that again? Jake. And what's your last name? Yeah, I'll tell you. I just need to see my license again so I can remember. Oh, there we go. I just pull up my name real quick. I already forgot my own name. That's your last name? There we go. Uh, let me see here. Let me squint really hard here. Grandpa, put your glasses on. Why is he not saved now? Oh, it's Simons! Yeah, there it is! I can see it! Just barely! Okay. Alright. Just go ahead and sit tight for me. Alright, deputy! Why are there so many of you? Well, we have one unit here for them, because we're in their city. And me and the uh, deputy witnessed you commit the crime. A crime? 
Yep, driving on opposite side of traffic. That's a crime. I haven't committed a crime since. Wait, how long ago? How many years is it? Uh, when were you last arrested? I've been. I've been, in my younger days. I was a troublemaker. That's not good. Well, you know what they say, man. Kids are kids. Listen, I know it's a nice truck, but I'd rather you not climb on it. My bad, my, my, my favorite's weekend. Uh, just my grandson recently bought it for me. He said my old truck was just too old. The nerve on that boy sometimes. Hey, sir. Hey there, how you doing? I'm doing well, I'm officer, uh... Yeah. Officer, yeah! That's <laughs> a great name, Frost. sir! Alright, Officer Frost. Oh, Frost! Oh, my bad! Right. You just said, oh, you just said yes, yeah, so I assume that was your actual name. My brain was working a little slow for me now, okay? Mine doesn't work at all at the time. Well, I can see that that moment, this moment. Right, what do you officer, mean by that? So all right, so I'm here on a jurisdiction call, okay? It means I'm just going to sit around and make sure everything's good. So I'm just introducing myself. Also, I overheard something about you, uh, your glasses being on your shirt, and that you were going to put it on later. Yeah. Like after the stop. How about you put them on now? We'll have to get out and do that. Why do you, why do you have to? Because they're not physically on my face, if you understand. What's that? They're not physically on my shirt, if you understand. Okay, okay, yeah, I got you. Okay. Alright. So if you want me to put them on, can I step out then? Uh, just, just sit tight for a second, okay? Alright. I was just trying to go visit my grandson. Yeah. Alrighty, sit tight real quick, okay? I'll be right back with you. Alright. What do you mean my grandson's in prison? Oh my god, okay. What, what do you mean my son? What do you mean? Uh, you, you You're a funny so jokes, do you know that? <laughs> you a prankster. Hey, oh, how's it going? How you so doing, you or for, or officer? Yeah. yeah. Here, what? Here, you can uh, you can step out and get your glasses on, okay? Okay. All right. There you go. Oh my back! That seat was very comfortable. There we go. I can see. All right, oh Patrick. wow! You guys are. It's like I'm looking at 4K, is what my grandson calls it. No, I bet it is. <laughs> well, I don't even know what 4K is. I bet you don't. Anyway, now I have one question for you. Do you remember the la when your driver's license was supposed was supposed to expire? Wait, these expire? Yes, driver's licenses expire. You, your your driver's license has been expired since 1996, and it's currently 2024. Oh. Well, I'm sorry about that. My wife usually does that. Your wife? Yeah, but she's gone. Here, do you... Okay. So, have you and is this is this driver's license currently the one that you first got when you first got your license? No, no, no. I've we've uh, we've renewed it a couple of times. I must have just slipped my mind. You know, I'm a very busy man. Okay. Well, you're aware, since obviously your driver's license has been expired for a very long time, you're aware that you shouldn't be driving, right? No, I didn't know that. I'm very sorry. Okay. Obviously, this is your vehicle. Um, 
Yeah, well, I guess my grandson so, got it for me. Okay, perfect. I'll right, just go and uh, get right here and I'll be back with you. Okay. Look, I'm really sorry if I caused you all trouble. I wasn't trying to hurt anybody. You didn't hurt anyone that we yeah, know thankfully. of. Yeah. I was just trying to go visit my grandson. My question is, your license has been expired since 1999. That's 28 years. Do you... Is, do you own this truck? Yeah, I do! How are you able to buy this truck without a valid license? I don't remember how- well, I'm not the one who bought the truck, so... I don't- I don't remember my grandson telling me how, he just said, Look, Grandpa, you got a- I got you a new truck! Isn't okay. it registered under your name? Yeah. You have to have a valid driver's license to register a vehicle under your name. Oh! That's true, too. Well, I mean, maybe my oh, grandson did it for me. I don't know. I don't know how that works. What's your grandson's name? What's his name? Yep. Yeah. Uh... What was his name again? Hi. Sir, do you have any medical diagnoses? Such as dementia, Alzheimer's, anything like that. Dementia? No, not not even close. Alzheimer's. What's that? You forget things. You for oh, I forget things. Or oh. short-term short memory loss. Not that I know of. Anything that may be restricting you from driving. Not that I heard of. I just, I just don't know. I don't know. I haven't been to the hospital in probably in 30 years. Okay. Hey, Deputy, did the play come back to his name? Yep. I'm so confused on how he was able to register this. His truck's definitely newer than a 1999. Oh, it's yeah, it's definitely newer, fire. all right, because I haven't seen this thing before until the other day. But I'm telling you, I love this thing. Oh, uh, uh, we can tell. Well, this is something I'm gonna be cutting you a huge break, okay? All right. Is that gonna be a $240 fine for your driver's license, okay? Uh, all right. You can keep your car and make sure you bring it back home, okay? I mean, yeah, I'll, I'll get it there. I'm just, I mean, I don't live around here though. That's the only problem. Yes. I was going to say, you live, you're currently far from home right now. Yeah, because my grandson lives up here. I'm going to visit him. All right, perfect. But once again, I'm cutting you a huge break here. I could easily tow your vehicle, but if we do see it again, we are going to have to tow it, okay? All right, I mean, maybe you guys can help me find my grandson then? You are looking for him? I just, I know he lives around here on this street. I just can't remember which one. What's his name? Uh, what's his name again? I already tried to get that album. He usually tells me his name because I don't know. He likes telling me his name, I guess. But it's been a while since I visited him. Okay. Now I need you to just think really hard for me so you can remember his name. Because uh, I can I can try to help you. I think his name is Liam. Liam, okay. Give me one moment. Oh and also real quick, did you wanna go ahead and just quickly sign here? Not admission of guilt, just to say yeah, that yeah, you'll yeah. either pay the final repair in court. Okay. There's a pen for you right there. Go. Wait, is it, are you sure this is your signature? 
Yeah, I'm sorry. Just looks like scribbles to me. Oh, I haven't had to sign anything in over 30 years. Okay, well, if you if you can't exactly remember your least cursive thing, so just Wait. try to write your first name as last. What? Okay. 30 years. I'm retired, son. Yes. Your license expired in 1999. It renews every two years. So 1997 is where you would have had to sign for that. And that was not 30 years ago. You have to sign every time you have to renew your license. I do? Yeah, you have to sign every time you renew your license. You have to sign every time you go to the doctor. You have to sign all, all the he time. Did, he did say he hasn't gone to the doctor since, well, 30, 30 years. Ago. Did I say 30 years? I think it was 40, actually. Okay. Well, that's even worse. <laughs> I don't remember. It's been a while. You, you, you should probably go to the doctors in that case. Yeah, you probably should call them, because I think you got some other stuff going on. Okay. Maybe my grandson will help me with that, then. You might want to move to the area with your grandson. Sounds like he's pretty good taking care of you. Where he got you a hundred thousand dollar truck. Oh, my son is very, er, yeah, my grandson is very successful. I don't know why I brought my son up into this. He's dead. Okay, what's up? I'm sorry. <laughs> that went dark real quick. Back, back, back to me. Did you okay. want to go ahead and just try to at least write your first name and last? So just bring scribbles. Listen, I am not crazy. Sorry about oh, that. No, you're not. Uh, uh, sorry, I wasn't talking to you. Uh, let me try again. There you go. I think I did it this time. There we go. Perfect. That's good enough. Sorry if it looked a little scribbly. Oh, thank you. Now, I will be right back. You said his name was Liam Simmons, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll be right back with you. Obviously, he's a local, so I'm gonna... Sir. Yeah? So that deputy is being pretty generous with you. So when you're gonna go and bring, uh, go to wherever that, uh, wherever your grandson's, uh, place is, you need to make sure now, especially when you got your glasses on, you need to drive on the right, okay? Oh, I will. I apologize. Okay. I, I really thought I was on the right side of the road. Now it happens. Oh, well, this is a little quiet around here. The silence is killing me. What's that, sir? Oh, nothing. Hey, Mr. Simmons. Yeah? Good news, his house is just right there. 
Oh, that's right, I forgot he said he got the front, the beachfront property, pretty much. All right. I told you, my grandson's very successful. I can tell. All right, perfect. Well, I don't have anything else to stop you for, but I do recommend that you get your license renewed and go see the doctors, please. Okay, yes, I get it, I'm sorry. I'll do it when I get right. there. Alright, anyway. You have a good rest of your morning, Mr. Simmons. You too, Deputy. Do you believe me that I'm a lonely soul?